All right, so get a light pink and put a little dab of it on a piece of paper. Now we will get a daughter and stick it into the, into the polish and you want to create a dot in the center like so. How big it depends on you. Um, I'm, I'm going to do a fairly smallish dot. You can also use a toothpick or a bobby pin or whatever. Next, with a, a paintbrush, we're going to create, paint on the hoops or the bunny ears of a bow, whatever you want to call it, on each side. So do the shape first, and then we're going to fill in using that same pink. Now with a slightly darker pink, we're going to create the hollows of the bow creating like you know the inside of it so I just do it like this right on the top of the bow and then go on the other side and do the same thing And when you're done with that, it should look like this. And now apply some clear coat. Well, yeah, you're going to get pink rhinestone, but get some clear coat and apply that to the, to the center of the bow. And then get whatever tool you use to pick up rhinestones. I'm using my daughter. And just stick that right there in the middle. And it looks like this. Now I'm going back to my paintbrush and the very tip of it and just dipping it into some of the darker pink and creating a series of little dots on the light pink. Make it polka dot. Then this black, I forget the name of it, but it's uh, it's it's not quite black black. It's like a smoky black, and I love this one for doing shading. So you want to get a striping brush. Um, I picked this one up at Sally's if you're interested. Now we're gonna create a thin line, and we're just gonna create a little bit of shading where the darker pink meets the lighter pink because the two pinks kind of fade together so you want to put something in there to separate the two of them and that black is perfect for it and here you go here's the finished look such a cute and easy bow